This uh, truck is completely anonymous. It does not need any other systems to operate. So you can drive this truck without any assistance, any preconditions on any infrastructure whatsoever. It drives by itself, it's autonomous. It's, it's uh, a strange feeling. Uh, but after a couple of kilometers, uh, I'm very, very comfortable. I feel very safe. Uh, I will feel very secure. And uh, I have to say, it's really fun to drive the truck. Actually, it's very simple, right? You push that button and you lean back and relax. So that's all that it's about. Everything else has been done by the system. The system takes over and pilots you to the traffic. It's just great, it's a good feeling. The 50% target was definitely a, a daunting goal. We want to develop the most fuel efficient truck running on the streets in North America. The question was, how aggressive would we need to be? Each individual manufacturer received a Department of Energy Super Truck Grant. We immediately embraced it because it fit exactly our long-term strategic plans. We want continuously to improve fuel efficiency. They not only want us to look at technologies that could be implemented in, say, the next five to seven years, but also technologies that were 10 years or plus out. We had to do a clean sheet approach. We looked at the very beginning over the external aerodynamics of the vehicle. You try to take your ideas and shape it into something and then test it and you say, okay, is that aerodynamic? And once you get there, it's, it's a question of how do you turn that into a real truck? So the first phase was identifying and measuring our baseline and then figuring out what we needed to do to get to 50%. The cooling team had to work with the aerodynamic team to say, okay, yes, we both need to meet our goals, but how do we do it together? Walmart's advanced vehicle experience. What you're seeing in the video is the powertrain, which is made up of a micro turbine, a battery storage system, and an electric motor. Moving inside the cab through the sliding driver's door, you'll see the key difference that allowed for the more dramatic aero design. The driver sits in the center of the console rather than over to the left. The dash is electronic and therefore customizable to the gauges and performance data that a particular driver wants to monitor. And it's all finished off with a full-size, comfortable sleeper. Moving on to the trailer, not only is this the first time a trailer has been made out of carbon fiber, but it's actually the first time one piece, 53 foot panels of carbon fiber have been manufactured. Looking at the front of the trailer, you can see that the nose is convex, which increases the aerodynamics of the entire package, as well as adding additional cargo space inside the trailer.
The spirit of invention can be felt in certain places. It can be found in certain people. The Wright brothers called these outer banks their home for years. This is where their invention was born, where their dream took flight. In 2011, our inventors set the wheels in motion on the super truck project. A challenge set before us by the U.S. Department of Energy to build a truck that improves freight efficiency by 50%. The focus was the entire vehicle. I mean, the only part we carried over from production was part of the cab, the body in white. So this was a unique opportunity where we were able to optimize the entire vehicle, tractor and trailer together. The entire dynamic development was driven by simulation, which is what we use to evaluate the aerodynamic property of a particular model, and then we iterate on the process to tweak that model to get the maximum aerodynamics we can get out of it. We had people working on the powertrain, of course, uh, dedicated to the powertrain improvements. We had a whole team dedicated to the vehicle improvements. At the end of the day, it was all about building this complete vehicle that everybody was a part of. One of the most important lessons that we learned during the powertrain development for a super truck was how important it is to consider everything as a system. So we took a very systematic approach developing not only the powertrain components, but marrying those components to the transmission and the whole truck. This whole truck is the system that was created together, so that's the innovation of thinking about a vehicle in this way instead of a tractor or a trailer or just an engine or a transmission. In the end, creating one of the most advanced and efficient trucks ever built. A global team dedicated to making our own dreams take flight. Driven by a culture of innovation, continuous improvement, stubbornness, dedication, passion. We built this together. This is Volvo Super Truck. More than 3,000 pounds lighter. 40% less drag. 70% better fuel economy. Fuel efficiency is at the heart of Volvo's innovation and design. 